Hello everyone and thank you for being part of uh, the United chapter and please subscribe and ring that notification bell so you do not miss and whatever I've got to bring to as long as this post and as long as this match United related right about at the United chapter Sofian Amrabat great news and also uh, we've got great news from Atalanta as regarding uh, the football player Rasmus Hoyland who is an Atalanta in Danish professional football player very good striker so uh, let us know which part of the world you are Watching from which part of the country you definitely are watching from as I'm more than happy uh, to get into the comment section and uh, read uh, what you will be typing anyway a match tonight will be remember the match tonight had had uh, two games and uh, one of them that uh, the other was not so big a game you know uh, the Rex Ham game we can't uh, blame anybody really but uh, the biggest game was Arsenal Manchester United and that game really uh, ended up with a win uh, from the club Manchester United United, a uh, United thoroughly uh, beat Arsenal badly, hands down, and that was great news for the club. Manchester United with uh, Jordan Sancho really uh, scoring a goal uh, in a long period of time. Uh, Jordan Sancho really played quite well, and also not forgetting that uh, the current captain of Manchester United, Bruno Fernandes, also uh, managed to score a wonderful goal, and that was the opener, two 0 It was definitely quite good. And then uh, not forgetting that in the second beat of the game where we had the penalties uh, definitely also uh, Manchester United beat Arsenal every uh, match United uh, penalty taker put it behind the net well as uh, Fabio Vieira from uh, the club uh, Arsenal failed to score and that was great news for the club Manchester United let us know what you definitely think about the football game that was on then and do not forget that Manchester United is going to be playing uh, Real Madrid is it tomorrow not very far from now so uh Manchester United is going to be playing Real Madrid it's going to be a very wonderful game uh, please stick around if you definitely want to have a watch along with me definitely you can always stick around so uh, let us know what you think about the football players and them joining uh the club Manchester United we're talking about Sofian Amrabat and the one and only uh, uh the one and only the Atalanta in Danish professional football player Rasmus Hoyland. I've got uh, the latest from uh, Rasmus Hoyland and uh, Fabrizio Romano has tweeted and said a few things about uh, the football player and also uh, Sofian Amrabat. I've got a bit of news coming in from uh, Sofian Amrabat. Anyway, uh, let us know where you are watching from, uh, which part of the world you're definitely watching from. You'll be remembered that uh, the football player, let's start with, uh, let's start with um, uh, Rasmus Hoyland. We'll remember that Rasmus Hoyland is one of those football players that has been linked to the club uh, Manchester United for a while. And uh, we'll remember that Manchester United has uh, put in the first bid that was rejected. And now Manchester United is putting in another bid, a second bid that is uh, worth £60 million. And it will be remembered that £60 million, £60 million euros, somewhere around there, will be remembered that £10 million uh, is for additional uh, 10 million is for add-ons well as as 50 million is uh, a fixed fee that is uh, how uh, it is broken uh, it's broken down so uh definitely things are not going on quite bad for the club Manchester United as United is trying his level best to make sure that they can get the best of football players and it will be put to note that there is a bit of a struggle for Rasmus Hoyland with the club Paris Saint-Germain Paris Saint-Germain PSG really coming out and saying that they have big interest in the football player and they want the football player to play for them it really leaves us with quite a lot to uh, question. Why is uh, the club really uh, Paris Saint-Germain coming at this moment in time to try and hijack a Manchester United target? Anyway, uh, that is uh, quite often in football, but uh, recently Manchester United was uh, enjoying uh, its soleness when it comes to uh, the football transfer of uh, the target uh, Rasmus Hoyland. We'll remember that... Uh, Paris Saint-Germain is trying to uh, talk to him and uh, make sure that he can uh, join PSG but uh, his preference is not going to PSG his preference is playing uh, for the club Manchester United it's quite great news I must say it's wonderful news uh, for Manchester United that uh, Rasmus Hoyland is not interested in going to PSG despite the fact that PSG is really into a move uh, 
PSG wants to pay him quite a lot of money, is willing to do anything for him to join, but his preference is not with PSG. So Manchester United really need to act fast so that they can uh, get the football player to prevent a hijack because, you know, sometimes uh, money can uh, make a football player decide otherwise. Anyway, uh, let, us know, uh, let us know what you definitely think in the comment section and do not forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell so you do not miss out on whatever I've got to bring to you as long as this post and as long as it is Manchester United related right about here at the United chapter uh, with me, your very host, Abu Khal. So I'm definitely dedicated to bringing to you the latest traits as it comes in. So uh, we've got uh, still a lot more of football players to talk about. Uh, whom should we talk about? Uh, let's, be, uh, let's talk about Sofian Amra. But so uh, you'll be remember that Sofian Amrabat is one of those uh, football players that has been linked to uh, the club uh, Manchester United for a while. And uh, there is quite a big number of football players uh, that have been linked to Manchester United. But to be specific, Sofian Amrabat has been linked to Manchester United. And uh, Manchester United has also gone on and uh, showed quite big interest in the football player by uh, definitely going to uh, the club uh, uh, Fiorentina and having a few talks uh, with the Fiorentina management about how Manchester United can definitely go on and uh, sign the football player, Sofian Amrabat. It is reportedly said that Manchester United is now uh, focused uh, on uh, Erasmus Hoyland and Erasmus Hoyland is almost done and uh, once the deal is done sealed and confirmed manchester united will definitely head on to yet another football player and the football player that we are talking about is none other than uh, the one and only um, Sofian Amrabat, who is a Moroccan uh, international football player, but also uh, it will be remembered that he does not only play for uh, the Morocco uh, national team, but he also uh, plays for uh, Fiorentina. And if you watched how Morocco played really in the World Cup, it definitely was the best of times for Morocco, wasn't it? Anyway, uh, let us know what you definitely think in the comment section, and do not forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell so you do not miss out on what Ava I've got to bring to you as long as this sports and as long as it is Manchester United related right about here at the United chapter with me your very host Abu Khal so a lot is definitely going on a lot is happening and let's uh, hope everything really uh, goes on quite well for the club Manchester United as Manchester United is trying his love best to make sure that they can get a few more football players so Romeo Lavia is one of the football players that was linked to the club Manchester United but by the look of things uh, Romeo Lavia is going to yet another club another football player uh, that is leaving Manchester United uh, uh, we're talking transfers really he's already left and that's uh, Anthony Alanga and he's uh, written uh, he's definitely written uh, emotional goodbyes to the club Manchester United him saying he did not know that when he arrived in the United Kingdom at 11 years that he would really uh, be a superstar play for Manchester United the biggest club in the world be free to let us know what you think about other football stars that we are talking about in the comment section. And please do not forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell so that you do not miss out on whatever I've got to bring to as long as this post and as long as this Manchester United related right about here at the United chapter with me, your very host, Abu Khal. So. Moises Caicedo, our chances of him are joining the club. Manchester United are still very limited and extremely uh, limited because uh, when you see uh, that Moises Caicedo really uh, at this point in time is being linked to uh, the club Chelsea. Chelsea has already had two bids rejected, uh, £60 million and £70 million. Uh, really, uh, is it now definitely means that they ha any any football uh, club that is interested in the football player obviously has to be paying a bit more money than that, and uh, that definitely implies that Moises Caicedo, uh, Manchester United, Manchester United chances of signing him are really narrowing down. Anyway, now uh, let's hope everything uh, goes on quite well for the football player uh, Moises Caicedo, and um, possibly. 
Uh, you know, with football, we can never say never. We hope that Manchester United can definitely sign the football player. Moises Kaisedo. And uh, you can let us know what you definitely think in the comment section. And please do not forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell so you do not miss uh, on whatever I've got to bring to you. As long as this sports and as long as it is Manchester United related right about here at the United chapter with me, your very host. Abu Kals, as we've been talking transfers, uh, let's meet in yet another video. Otherwise, thank you. And I think if I say goodbye for now, I would not have, uh, have done anything bad. Thank you and goodbye for now.